how's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. The body beat down here, Michael, at your most humble service. Today is leg day, and today I'm focusing only on squats. I'm not going to go up heavy. I think probably I'm going to top out about 225. I say that, but then usually I switch things up and go stupid. So here I am. If you know, a couple days back, I bent my one bar that I keep in here on this rack. So I got my other bar in here right now. Uh, this bar here is typically what I use for my deadlifts and other stuff in my actual main gym. So, I got another bar uh, that I'm going to go pick up. It's just I got to wait to get paid. Uh, but somebody here in town has a, a bar that I'm uh, going to get. So, anyway, I'll have a new bar pretty soon. So, we're doing squats. I'm actually on my second set of 135. And I just kind of wanted to do some video uh, referencing to check my form and just see if I'm getting close enough to depth. If any of you know, if you watch my videos, you know I have chronic bad back. My shoulders are absolute garbage. My neck is garbage. I can't reach back really and hold the bar, but I do the best I can. And I try to do squats as best I can. I'm not looking to compete. I don't care if I'm spot on 100% with my form and all that kind of stuff. I don't care about all that. That's not what I'm working out for. I'm working out for health and fitness and uh, for bettering myself and adding a little muscle and uh, strength. So I don't care what everybody else is doing. Uh, I kind of, kind of, I kind of have to do things my way when it comes to some things. So uh, I'm going to get a different view of this so I can kind of get a look see of how I'm doing because I, I still like to make myself proud. And that's the main reason to do anything in life is make yourself proud first. So. Let's get another set of some 135s going and uh, see how we do. all right those felt pretty good so that was my second set of 135 i threw some uh, 25s on the side so that's 185 and we'll see how these goes guys these goes guys these goes guys let's see how they uh, they go So those went pretty well, it seemed like. I feel like I'm doing pretty good on them. Uh, my range of motion feels really good for me. Pretty happy. I put a 10 on each side as well. 10, 25, 45. So now we're looking at 205 pounds. Again, I'm only gonna go up to 225, so I'm gonna do a set of this, and then I'm gonna do a set of 225. and. Uh, I'll probably call it done on the free weight squats and then I'm going to swing over to the Smith machine and do some squats on there. So let's get these done guys. Six. 
atas dia. Hey, I was pretty impressed with those. They felt pretty good. Of course, I don't know until I watch the footage, but they felt really good. And I'm glad I pushed out 10 of them. Now I've went up to 225. I just stuck a 10 on each side again. 10, 10, 25, 45, and the bar is 45. So 225 is where I'm stopping at. I'm just doing one set. Uh, and I'll talk about kind of what I'm doing with legs after we get done today and uh, why I'm deciding to do kind of what I'm doing. So let's uh, get this 225 done and see how we feel about that. Uh, All right, guys, we got our free weight squats done. Really, really proud of myself. On that last set, uh, I guess I was a little close to the safeties, you know, at the bottom here, the safeties, and my arm was actually touching the safety. That lets me know I was doing really good as far as my depth goes for me. Again, I'll have to look at the footage and uh, see Man, that felt really good. And I didn't push myself too stupid. I made myself stop uh, to know that I'm getting in decent reps without compromising, you know, my form or my back or anything too much. Of course, my shoulders absolutely burn and, and kill me the whole time. Uh, but that's just a part of it. But overall, they felt great. Now, I was squatting with my legs uh, a fair decent bit apart. Uh, I feel like I get better range of motion that way. Number one, back, hips, knees, ankles. All of mine are bad. I'm not going to bore you with it, but they're all bad. So I don't have a lot of great range of motion in any of my, any of my body, really. So uh, opening up my feet a little bit allowed me to have a little bit better flexibility and mobility. And uh, it felt good. And uh, as far as the grip went, I just kind of used whatever grip felt kind of okay-ish for the moment. It might have been all the way to the ends, or it might have been kind of close to me as, you know, best I could do. And uh, I'm stopping here, and I'm not going to kill myself with the legs because I feel like maybe I'm overdoing it sometimes, and I'm probably not. But I feel like I'm kind of overdoing things because, let's face it, I'm not in my 20s anymore. I'm not on any special supplements gear you know what we're talking about there steroids and all that kind of stuff testosterone and hgh and all these other things i'm not on anything like that i'm not getting in thousands and thousands of calories i'm not you know feeding my body that kind of stuff and i think maybe i'm overdoing it in some of my lifts maybe i'm overdoing it just a little bit and wearing it out and it kind of has the reverse effect instead of maybe building a bigger muscle uh, it starts to start uh, kind of maybe eating away at it because you don't have the fuel in there uh, fueling that muscle and that workout for that long of period of time and that much stress and strain just my theory leave comments please guys let me know what you think uh, so anyway uh, I hate to keep this going now I'm gonna go over here and do some Smith machine squats uh, 
mixing the two is good because you get a little bit different feel from both and uh, the Smith machine allows me to not have to worry too much about you know control or anything I just get to work out the legs and that's what we're here to do is work out the legs so really happy with what I did here I'm not gonna film over there on the Smith machine I don't want to bore you too much but I just want to show you this and show you uh, you know I'm, I'm kind of changing it up and taking it a little bit easy on some of these things maybe maybe gonna switch things up a little bit don't be scared to switch things up just a bit so guys I appreciate you watching like share subscribe comment all that good stuff too the body beat down me eh. Michael your incredible host get up get out get rad do it to it and we'll see you next time on the body beat down be awesome and uh, get some workout done take care of yourself Get up, get out, get mad, and do it, do it!